my lovely TTs, welcome back to the channel. Ari is Moneybag Yo's girlfriend of what they're saying is five years, and Juicy is, of course, Moneybag Yo's baby mama, in which they share two kids together. Despite Moneybag Yo having multiple baby mamas, Juicy has been the one that Ari has had the most problems with, as we have seen on social media. It really starts off with people assuming that Juicy copies Ari. Fans put together throwback pictures in a collage of Juicy repeating looks that we'd see Ari in. Now we know the drama and the messiness has been going on for some years between these two. Stemming all the way from three years ago, Juicy decided to be messy. After seeing Moneybag Yo surprise Ari on Valentine's Day, she insinuated that she still had something going on, maybe some intimacy going on with her baby daddy, even though she knew that he was in this newfound relationship. Now seven months ago, Juicy went off after Ari did an interview on Carisha Please, reiterating the rumor that was going around that Juicy, Moneybag Yo's baby baby mama is a let's just say p toot if y'all know what i mean now i could go on and on but i think this recent situation has been the messiest and i'm kind of scared that things are going to get worse and i'm really scared about ari with this situation now let's go ahead and get into where this started now ari posted this picture on her insta story and as you can see her shirt says his ex is my biggest fan now of course juicy decided to clap back and i really thought this was a publicity stunt at first because no way these two are getting custom made shirts this fast but Juicy responded back and she said tell your boyfriend to stop calling me now this was what was on her shirt now I thought this was a little crazy a little wild anyways Juicy also posted on her insta story and she said he run back to me because you born a Anna my favorite mf lyric definitely seemed like some shade towards Ari now Ari decided to post on her twitter and she said drop some receipts or leave it on the playground okay I know that's right and I can understand where Ari is coming from because it's like you can't continue to say this man is flirting with you he uh wants to do stuff with you he still wants to be with you but you're never posting the receipts i have really have not seen juicy post the receipts of where money bag yo was texting her or calling her like at least post something like that and this has been going on for years now now ari also posted and she said you on your page promoting fraud and getting child support you live in a effing airbnb we call you the cafeteria lady you a p2 that he got pregnant nobody is effing up about him but you okay now this is something that is very true this is something that i noticed about juicy and i'm not on nobody's side here i did want to let you guys know look i'm not on anyone's side here but i did notice this about juicy she does like to promote fraud and i want to let you guys know and just everybody any celebrity for the influencers and celebrities who are promoting frauds they only care about the money they do not care about you please do not be out here thinking that you can flip two hundred dollars into two thousand dollars or eight hundred dollars into eight thousand dollars that is just not true it really does not make any sense so do not be sending these people your money i don't care if it's your favorite influencer and like i said i did notice that this is something that juicy does all the time she's always promoting fraud on her page okay which i just don't think is okay but i digress anyways juicy also posting she says ms can't never put a name on ish because they p-u-s-s-y-a-f only thing mental is your fake happy a-s-s it be the ms you least expect they'll be watching like a mf on god right game but the wrong b f you mean now money bag yo actually did decide to get into this he decided to respond on his twitter and he posted and he said ain't nobody talking about me and it's like obviously money bag yo everybody is talking about you okay specifically your baby mama juicy and your girlfriend Ari are talking about you and they're going back and forth about you who else are they talking about okay now Ari responds back to money bag yo on twitter and she says don't say nobody say your baby mama it's been five years of blanking and h harassment okay let's just say it that way this ish is so beneath me okay now juicy responds back and she says five years of what yes yeah, somebody been misleading you real bad jigsaw ain't no way you thinking this you won goofer a s s b i see i blank in h ras who main you lost in the mf sauce it's sad then she said airbnb question mark ask him do i live in an airbnb bookie like i said all your info is wrong af stupid a 
ASS. Then she said, yeah, you dumb for real. I see. Like I said, goofer ASS B, okay? The way that Juicy is coming for Ari, it definitely seems like there's some animosity there. Like I said, for me personally, I feel like there may be some jealousy there because she feels like, look, I'm the baby mama. You know, I had two kids by you. Why can't I be the chosen one and you're deciding to date this person? It might be that or maybe, I don't know, Ari is saying some stuff about her behind the scenes. But I mean, Juicy is kind of making it look bad for her to where it's hard to be on her side. I'm really trying to understand her. But hey, she does promote fraud and I do see her coming for Ari a lot and she's been doing it for years. It's surprising that she hasn't just moved on into a new relationship to where she doesn't care about her baby daddy money bag yo but she might still have some hope that they will get back together who knows anyways money bag yo posted this and he deleted this and he said people be so weird shaking my head like i said this was deleted now i know a lot of you guys always tell me that i need to stay factual but i already got into the facts those were the posts now let's go ahead and get into my opinion honestly my opinion is ari did post and she said this stuff is way beneath her and if she honestly really feels like this stuff is beneath her then she needs to leave it just that beneath her maybe she needs to question her relationship with money bag yo I understand that Ari and money bag yo have been together for a while now as she is saying five years but if you have to continue to go through this with his baby mother you have to understand his baby mother his kids are a part of his package just like Ari her kids her baby daddy she herbo is a part of her package and if she feels like she cannot handle this or his package is beneath her then maybe she needs to reevaluate or try to move on from the relationship also i really didn't like the fact that i didn't feel like money bag yo was standing up for ari just saying that oh nobody is talking about me or people are weird it's not really defending your current girlfriend against your baby mother but then again i understand that this is kind of a hard place for money bag yo as he may be trying to keep a cool relationship with his baby mother juicy just to see his kids and juicy is kind of taking it the wrong way or trying to flirt with him just because she simply doesn't like the fact that Ari and Moneybag Yo are together still to this day after allegedly five years of them being together. I can understand because this situation would be annoying to me as well to have a baby mama who is literally always trying to antagonize you, come for you, always trying to get back with her baby daddy. But Ari has to understand that this is the baggage that comes along with the man that she chose to be with. So it's either she could try to kind of work things out with Juicy or just let Juicy keep on doing what she's doing and stay with Moneybag Yo. I mean, if Moneybag Yo is completely honest and loyal with Ari and communicating with her and letting her know everything i guess it shouldn't be so much of a problem but if ari really has to question Moneybag's loyalty and she always has to defend herself when it comes to situations like this and against his baggage then like i said mm, maybe you should see if you want to stay in that relationship because in all honesty yes i think these women are falling in love with the fact that money bag yo is a rapper he has a lot of money and that's it i mean ari obviously she gets a lot of attention from not only females but guys as well and she could choose a guy who just has really good money who's regular he doesn't have to be a rapper but maybe he's making a good living maybe he's making more maybe he's making a lot of money i mean ari is not a bad looking woman she is a very pretty woman so she can definitely definitely have a different guy if she wants to she gets all this attention i'm pretty sure there's men and guys in her dms probably even basketball players and stuff why she's staying with money bag yo i really think it's because of comfortability and probably some of the nice things that money bag yo has done for her in the past but ari has to understand that she does have one kid while money bag yo has multiple children not saying that having children makes you less of a prize but i'm saying that ari within the situation with her having one kid with her being this lovely beautiful female who you know is curvaceous who a lot of men want she is definitely to me the prize in her relationship with her and money bag yo and she definitely needs to remember that i honestly think that since money bag yo has gotten with ari i can almost guarantee he's probably got more deals um obviously he got her to be in his music
music video. I mean, I'm pretty sure he has got more fans and everything. I really think that he gains from being with Ari and Ari has to understand that. I really hope that Moneybag Yo is not using Ari, but from what I heard from certain men and like asking questions, usually when you have that many baby mamas, it's hard for you to continue to date and actually develop real feelings for somebody new, especially when you just have all these women who have your kids. Obviously there is feelings there for the kids, so I just think that Ari should have thought about that before she actually decided to get quote unquote married or in a relationship with Moneybag Yo. But I want to know you guys' thoughts and opinions about this in the comment section. Once again, thank you for watching Room for Tea. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time I upload. I will have more videos coming out, some good ones so you don't want to miss it. I will see you guys in my next video. Have a blessed rest of your night.